Hey guys, Hang Game 3 here, and welcome to my room. It's great. Kind of. It's my games. As you can see, just going down here. Double May Cry 4, Animal Crossing, Magic and Nights and Bolts, Mad World, F Zero, Taiho, World Talk, Taiho 3. More games over here under my Mario fin. I've got a lot of games. It's just. This is for my uh, 50 subscribers special. I said I was going to do it eventually, and might as well be now. It's a sweet spots there. Over here, it will balance against the wall. If you can see. You're probably thinking, oh, that's not much. Well, let's dive into the first floor. Going up. Put some more there. I'll go up a bit more. Yeah. And one more floor. As we can see, I have a lot. And this is only a bit of them. I've got a lot more to show you. So here I've got Fire Emblem, the Path of Radiance for the GameCube. This game's worth, I don't know, probably over a hundred bucks. Pretty rare. Power region, as all my games usually are. Um, I'll show you the disc. Just give me a second. There's the disc, there's the... What's it called? Manual. Enclosed manual. Oh, okay. Now we've got Kirby's Air Ride. Power region. Uh, pretty rare. As you can see, disc. Manual and behind it, so I don't want to show that actually. I think it's a rip, but... Behind it is uh, GameCube. Close on me. GameCube and some of the shiny games like Double Dash. Don't actually own Double Dash. Yeah. Okay, here I've got Beam Street for the Wii. It's called Fortune Street in other regions and other names. Let's see. Not that rare of a game at all. You can probably pick it up for like 10 bucks or so. It's a good game though. It is a really good game if you're into Monopoly styles uh, stuff. But I've also got a. Look at the sound of the Four Swords Adventures, easily worth over a hundred dollars. Pretty rare game. As you can see, I've just opened it up. Clear the disc and the instruction booklet. Got Pikmin 2 here. Mm, I don't know if I've read it, but it's got a nice box art for this style, I think. The giant lobster and all. I always found it kind of funny, you get the blue Pikmin following and everything. Is inside of it and the uh, instruction booklet. Same as the cover, as you can see. At least the back. So I'm showing any of the games at the back here, I guess. Just yeah. to let you guys know, most of my games were purchased on eBay. Anyway, this was the limited edition version of Wind Waker, which got a 10 out of 10 there. And if I open it up, you can see it comes with Legends of Ocarina of Time Master Quest Edition. I know how rare this is, but together with actual booklets and everything intact really good condition I guess it's worth around 50 or 60 bucks not too sure but it's it's a pretty good find if you find it over back here I've got charges I've got my uh, 3ds collection here I can pick it up okay Kid Icarus uh, Mario Tennis Open Super Mario 3D Land Mario Kart 7 uh, Super Pokemon Rumble, Star Fox 64 3D, and Solution of Ocarina of Time 3D. Yeah, we have my controllers, my uh, classic controller for the Wii, which is a classic pro controller. A gold controller that comes with Skyward Sword. Uh, just normal greenish blue 64 controller see-through. Uh, Xbox control, playing control back there. There's a couple down here, but uh, light inside showing it good. So let's pull them out. Got my black 360 controller. I got another plain 64 controller here. Uh, back there, I got see-through purple, which comes with the 64 uh, Wii modes, second Wii modes, PlayStation 2 control. Uh, my online GameCube controller I use it's broken here. Uh, other GameCube control and that's pretty much all for my controls. Yeah, we have my only PS1 game, Mega Man Legends. I got it about a week and a half ago. Open it 
open it up. Let's see back at the enclosed manual and the Mega Man Legends disc itself. This is also power region. Take another look at it. Answer back. This game's relatively rare for my understanding. Chipped, but 64 games I already own. This is Doom 64. Majora's Mask is second. Decon Racing. Uh, Lilat Wars, aka Star Fox 64. Goldeneye. Star Wars Racing. Uh, Legend of Zelda Crane of Time. And I don't have a double of this. This is uh, my 007 game for the 64. This was given to me by one of my friends which I hope he'll be in some of my LPs recordings that are coming up. And here we have my Wii U controller and some of my games. Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. Pokemon Crystal. Pokemon Leaf Green. And Sebastian Treaty. Yeah, the kind of random play there after I show you all those games, but hey. This is me showing you all my games, I guess. My Pokemon Gold. Most of my cartridges are in really good condition. So you still got the sparkle effect coming off it. Let's see the back. Nice and clean. Uh, my Pokemon Blue, as you can see, the sticker for the titles ripped off and cleans like that. A uh, reason for this, my Pokemon Blue and I'll get my Crystal as well. My Pokemon Crystal are actually games that my auntie found for me back in 2001. They were in the hotel room and people had already left and they left these two games for me. How nice of them, huh? Yeah. More Pokemon games here. I've got Pokemon Trading Card Game for the Game Boy Color. Pokemon Yellow for Game Boy Color, I believe. Is it Color or this Game Boy? I think it's this Game Boy. I think they're both this Game Boy. I didn't mind about that. Uh... Pokemon Silver, this one is actually kind of broken, I brought it from Cash Converse a while ago, and memory started doesn't work on it, dead battery I Some guess. of my games, yep, as you can see there's a lot more in there, like Goldeneye and Bombman Heroes, and Pokemon Stadium, and Pokemon Stadium 2 back there, I don't think you can see that, and also Super Smash Brothers, but eh, oh, it's Goldeneye, I'll show you this one, uh, Pokemon Snap, Oh, this is really rare. Um, the Cyber Kids 2 game, the Power Region one, it's worth around 100 bucks because it was only sold in Australia and not in any other Power Regions. Uh, Cyber Kids 1 here. Yeah. Pokemon 64 and The Legend of Zelda Crane Time. Mystical Ninja starring Gomon. Mario Kart 64. Banjo Kazooie. Star Wars Racing and Majora's Mask. I want a good estimate of actually how many 64 games I have, well, here you go. Just goes up to the back of it. Still can't see, I'm going to try to shake it a bit more, but it's the best I can do. This is the end right here. So end there, so just estimate that from how many games you can see. My pouch, which you get with uh, Pokemon Emeralds upon buying it, is filled with a lot of games. I can pull them all out right now just to demonstrate. There's some there. There's Emerald there, Fire Red. Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Harry Potter. Yeah, I've got some more in here. Dragon Ball Z, Mario Tennis, Metabots, and oh man, I've got all the Duel Master games with like Game Boy Advance, I think. But uh, more Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Dungeon Dice Monsters, Banjo Kazooie, uh, Sims Red Ride and Red Duel Masters, and such things probably can't see, but a couple more, which is another Duel Masters, uh, Links to the Past, uh, the Pokemon Episode 1 viewer, and Dragon Ball Z, Legend of Goku 2. Now I've got some more in the back, which are my DS games, well, that's what you can see, but heaps of DS games, but I'm going to pull them all out, it's hard enough to pull the Game Boy ones back in, so there's some of them, got more in there, pull, pull this section out too, I guess. So yeah, as you can see, just to prove I have more, I'm going to pull one more out of here. So you one there, put one pearl I believe, yes, and 
If we get more light, see so you can see them all in there. Okay, here you can see my handhelds. Got my Game Boy Advance, my Game Boy Advance SP, which is a Rip Curl edition. My standard DS, my DS Lite, and if I won't be able to show you my last one because it's here. I'm using it right now to record. So yeah, that's all my DSs and Game Boy. I was thinking what else I can show you. So I found some of my Pokemon cards, and you can see it's about this big. It's my collection. Got some rare ones in there, some not so rare. Got Growlithe there. It's Golden Jungle set. So upside down fire. <laughs> what's his name? Uh, Weaving Bell. Uh, what's this? It's Carnivore. Rhyhorn. Ah, uh, yeah, stuff like that. Look a ton. Marowak. Cards like that. I don't know of the Pokemon Stadium game. Nintendo decided to release these uh, action 3D collectors holographic cards. This is my collection here. So got, they turn from bulbs on things, so depending on how you flick them. I've actually got them all of the cards. So, um, it goes up to a pretty big number. How many Pokemon are actually in here? But <laughs> also it says their name at the bottom. It's pretty cool. Look at the side duck and gold duck. Try them up there. Try them up's actually pretty cool. It like it seems in back forward and out. I like how they've done this like can I take off I believe, or is this like hey nice it's it's like hey nice I think. Is the Havra, Kadabra, and Alkazam. And the Machop family. Which is cool. Uh, Geodude. Drio. Grima. Grima Slick seems in. Hypno's over there. Hitmon Lee. Stami. Cypher, uh, Electabuzz, Electabuzz looks really cool, the card is on it. Tauros, Gyarados, then we've got the Eevee family, I believe, Lapso, uh, Lapso, Lapras, Eevee and its family evolutions, Jolteon, uh, you pretty much have to kill them, and they, so you have to find the basic Eevee, this is the basic Eevee card, where it doesn't, trans oh, it trans on the player. Okay, that's good enough. It's Eevee. Yeah, Eevee, I right, it's the power one anyway. It's all basic Eevee. Septos, Dragonites. Yeah, these are something that these are like a premium version cards, like promo cards. They're Charizard, uh, Pikachu, Poliwell, Gengar, or Gengar. Uh, Electroid, or uh, Cube Tops, Aerodactyl, Mewtwo, let's see how you can see it, and I don't know how rare Meowth was, but Meowth is very rare since it had gold backgrounds. This showing you guys Majora's Mask, it's, it's my 64, I'll just try to tilt the camera so I can just show you it's on, and then I'm using my, uh, I can show you his control, my Pokemon control, I got from my friend. Let's play quick file on it. Uh, let's see. I push start game. Okay, as you can see, my file. It's called the masks. I've completed the game 100% to my knowledge. I think I don't have all the heart though. I mean, I had all the masks, but not the hearts. Yeah, I don't have all the hearts by hearts by one shot. You should probably see there. I do have all masks in the game. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna show you guys my amazing, uh, glitch. I can do with a dog now, because I can. Now you just backflip and the dog will just hover down. I don't even know if you could see that or not. I'll try it again, just in case. 
my light flop. That way you'll be able to project it better. So it just hovers down. Yeah. So I don't know if I should show anything else. I think that's it. Blue's go. Oh my god. So yeah. So hey game three, thank you for watching this. I hope you enjoyed seeing all my stuff I've got and thanks for the fifty subs. That's all I've got to say. Um, where can I end this off? Hmm.